This is Iran. Although the currency of this country is the weakest currency in the world, this country is very rich. You will know about this country until the end of this video. It feels like you have landed on Mars when you reach one part of this country. It's possible that you still don't know much about this country because the media always speaks ill of it, saying that this country is very poor and terrorism is common here. But what is the reality? You will be amazed to know. Iran, officially known as the Islamic Republic of Iran, was once known as Fores in ancient history. And today, Fars is just one province of Iran. Iran is also called the mother of dry fruits. This country is beautiful, but so cheap that you won't believe it. Speaking of the history of Iran, the history of this country is more than 1,500 years old. The official religion of this country is Islam. Administratively, Iran is divided into 31 provinces. Its currency is called the Iranian Rial, which has a very low value. You get 40,000 Iranian Rials in only one U.S. dollar. This means if you bring 250 U.S. dollars to Iran, you become a millionaire here. No visa or MasterCard works in this country, so whenever you come here, you have to carry Iranian rials or British pounds, as American banks are completely banned here. That's why Iranians also have their own banking system here. You can pay digitally even at the smallest shops here. You must be aware that Iran is rich in natural gas and oil which is why the price of petrol is extremely low here. Speaking of its geography, Iran is bordered by Iraq, Turkey, Azerbaijan, Turkmenistan, Afghanistan, and Pakistan. The flag you are seeing was made on July 29, 1980. Its colors are red, white, and green, with a law written in the middle, meaning God. The capital of this country is Tehran, which is the largest city with a population of over 170 million. Tehran is not only the most advanced city in Iran, but also very cheap. It won't be wrong to call Tehran's Golestan Palace the eighth wonder of the world. 99% of the people in this city have love marriages, which is why divorce rates are also quite high here. In addition, when we talk about beauty, the names of Dubai and Qatar come to mind. But once you go to Tehran, you will see big buildings and luxurious malls here. Moreover, seeing the beautiful roads here, you will feel like you are in Dubai, and the cleanliness here will amaze you more than anything else. People in Iran are also extremely hospitable and have good hearts. They treat tourists with respect. In Iran, there is also an ancient AC system that existed thousands of years ago. Chimneys were built on top of houses that allowed cool air to come down and expelled hot air, meaning that the AC system was present in Iran thousands of years ago. According to Iranian law, all things supreme leaders of the country have control, and like other advanced countries, there is also a very advanced traffic system here. Travel within the country by air is extremely cheap because of the very cheap petroleum here. With just $40 to $50, you can travel across the country, and the largest airport in the country is also located in Tehran. In addition, metro systems and trains are available here at various places, which are also operated by petroleum, making the travel extremely low. Near Tehran is the village of Kandovan, the most beautiful village here, where ancient buildings will completely amaze you. These beautiful houses are built on top of large mountains. Speaking of tourists, this place is no less than heaven for them. The surprising thing is that the weather inside these houses naturally becomes warm in winters and cool in summers. Iranian carpets are also very famous worldwide, with extremely low prices but high demand. Mashhad City is Iran's second largest city, and the shrine of Imam Ali is also located here, where millions of Shia Muslims come every year to visit. Speaking of Iranian cuisine, it is said to surpass Pakistani and Indian cuisine. Friends, this was our informational video for today. I hope you liked this video a lot and learned a lot about Iran. If you want information about any other country,
please let us know in the comments and we will meet you in the next informational video. Until then, goodbye.